Dozens of Kenner residents lined Loyola Drive today to get some free water. And our Tiffany Wong picks up our team coverage with a look at how residents are coping with boil water advisories there. There you go. Cars lined up bumper to bumper at Kenner City Park, all waiting for the same thing. A pack of water. That reminds me of the Hurricane Katrina when you had to stay in line and get free stuff. Once stocked at grocery stores just a few days ago, now hard to get. Last night we started with the water we actually went out and purchased. We had about two flatbed trucks, probably 10 to 15 pallets on each one. We did not run out. Today, Zahn says the water was donated by a local businessman. He had a distributor in Houston. He was able to put all the water on there. I think it left Houston at 4 o'clock yesterday, got here last night. The mayor says the water pressure is back to normal and should stay that way. As mayor, as a council person, and a chief of police are very happy that the pressure is back because we had to deal with the worry of fires. We had a fire the other night. We had we actually had two the other night. We want to make sure that we had that pressure back to be able to get our fires put out for our safety reasons. This line goes as far back as the eye can see. Some people we spoke with say they've been waiting in line for hours. I've been waiting in line now for about an hour and 15 minutes. One of many trying to get clean water. Two days ago, we got down to just a trickle of water in the house. Um, since then, it's gone up a little bit, but not too much. It's made it difficult to, you know, do normal things like cooking and showering and just cleaning up around the house. Addressing some backlash from the community, Zahn says the city did what it had to do. There'll be some people out there that'll criticize what we did, that we went and spent some money um, to, to give the water out. I'm going to stand behind what we did. I think it's right. She's going to stand behind it. The council is going to stand behind it. And the chief, because we made those decisions before we went out there, we think it's the right thing to do. Again, while the water pressure is back to normal, the boil advisory for some Jefferson Parish residents is expected to last at least until the state test results come back clear. Shelly.